Hello everyone, welcome to our book talk for today. Today we're going to get started by talking about Scholastic Teachables. Scholastic Teachables is one of the electronic resources that our guests get for free with their membership. It includes printable lesson plans and coloring and activity sheets for preschool through grade six. You can access it by logging in our online catalog and scrolling on the left side uh, on the electronic resources section to find it. Our first book for today is an adaptation of the song Three Little Birds by Bob Marley, uh, by his daughter, Cedella uh, Marley, and illustrated by Vanessa Brantley Newton. It's called Every Little Thing, and in this illustrated version of Bob Marley's song, a young boy with the encouragement of three little birds enjoys life and will not let anything get him down. Bob Marley's songs are known for their powerful messages of love, peace, and harmony. Please check it out. And I also want to uh, show you our, in this book that is part of our Spanish collection, and it is Te Quiero Tal Como Eres, written by Tammy Salzano and illustrated by Ada Grade. It is part of our Spanish collection, as I mentioned, and this book captures the bond between the mother and the little child. And as she tells him how, and shows him how much she loves him just the way he is. The vocabulary is easy and it is a good thing. It's something you could try even if you are not a first uh, language speaker of Spanish. If your young reader is one of the many Dragon fans hanging around the library, they will love the Dragon Girls series by Maddie Mara. As Mina, Willa, and Naomi are thrilled to find out that they have the ability to transform into glitter dragons. They must use their newfound powers to protect the magical forest from shapeshifters called shadow sprites. Dragons, friendship, and glitter, what's not to love in this beginner chapter book? Hi there, our first graphic novel this week is No One Returns from the Enchanted Forest by Robin Robinson. In this book, Pix and Bella are goblin sisters living near the edge of the enchanted forest. When earthquakes threaten their home, foolish Pella takes off into the enchanted forest to confront the Earth Queen. More level-headed Bix must chase after her and try to rescue her from her foolish decisions and try and make it out of the enchanted forest alive. Will these two sisters succeed? You must find out. This graphic novel has lots of really incredible artwork and fantasy world building. And it's nice to see goblins be the hero for a change. Fantasy land fans will love No One Returns from the Enchanted Forest. Next up, we have King and the Dragonflies by Case and Calendar. This is set in a small town in Louisiana. The book opens up with 12-year-old Kingston James believing that his dead brother has transformed into a dragonfly. While King and his family must learn to deal with their grief, another problem develops. King's best friend, Sandy, has gone missing. He's hiding in the bayou, trying to escape his abusive father. King must figure out how to help Sandy, grieve for his brother, and possibly even come out to his family. This award-winning book is a must-read for all those interested in the power of learning to be your own complex self in a world that likes conformity and simplicity. Band Book Club by Kim Hyun Suk and Ryan Estrada is a great graphic novel for teens. Set in the early 1980s in South Korea, it reveals the life experiences of author Hyun Suk as she navigates her freshman year at college. There, she gets involved in an underground book club that reads books that have been banned by the totalitarian regime running the country. With the recent wave of book challenges in our own country, this is a particularly timely read. Stop by the Food Republic Library to check out all of these great books. 